Due to the graphic nature of this program, viewer discretion is advised. <laughs> with the men and women of law enforcement. All suspects are innocent until proven guilty in a court of law. I've been on the Jersey City Police Department 22 years. And I guess it's the self-gratification. You deal with the people, you see their downs, you see their ups. Uh, you're there more for the downs than their ups. So when you, when you catch them on that upright of uh, doing something nice for them, helping them out when they need you, that kind of strings you along. It uh, gets you through a lot of hectic times. I've had people die in my hands. I've had people born in my hands. So it's uh, just something that after 22 years, I probably could do 22 more. It's an exciting job and I love it. Well, I always say uh, the strongest muscle in your body is your tongue, because you gotta, you gotta work with your tongue, you gotta talk to people. If you can't talk to somebody, you know, the game is over, you're gonna have a hard time. And, and in this business, being a police officer, it's more so talking to people and communicating. You could have all the brawn in the world, it's not gonna get you anywhere. People don't believe in being brawny and pushing people around. You gotta be able to talk to them. And usually, uh, most situations, you can talk people down, calm them down, and then they start to understand your point of view, where you're coming from. Right now, uh, you got a suspected uh, drug dealer. He's uh, got a description from an off-duty officer. He's about a block away or so. We're gonna go see if he's by a bodega. About, uh, right now he's about two blocks away. Black male and uh, tall black male. Long sweatshirt. Uh, we're just gonna see if we can spot him. Hi, it's good for 148 North St. Abbey, Right here. Which one? Gray long uh, sweat jacket. To your right, right to your right. Put the beard down, Chief. Just put the beard down. West 703 Alpha, we have a foot pursuit going up Emory Street from Monticello. Tall black male wearing a gray hoodie, uh, blue jeans, work boots. You're done, bro. Get down on the ground. Get down on the ground. Emory. Put your hands behind your back. Hands behind your back. Give me the other hand. I'll keep him down you, where he ducked down. Go check. Turn your wrist. OK, Back. I'll keep him down here. He ducked down near that fence over there. Take. Come on, man. Uh, West 703 Alpha, disregard any other units. We got enough units off. We have them uh, cuffed and on the ground. Nine Charlie, nine Alpha, bro. You want to put them in the car? 11 a.m. where they have them? <clears throat> Emory Street, no. <sighs> got it? All right, come on up. You want to put him in your car? You yeah, got that? He'll just pat him down for weapons over here. All right, he had a bundle of heroin. Uh, as I was chasing him, coming around the corner here, went right to the front yard back here. I saw his hand go right into the bushes. He slowed up, I slowed up, and uh, backtracking. Got the goods. Under arrest. 
703 Alpha, we have him. He's uh, under arrest in cuffs, recovered one bundle of CDS heroin, heading into the West. He made me run today. <laughs> hey, I gotta get my cardio in somehow. <laughs> You're quick, bro. I caught you. You got it, Rose? All right. Let me get a bag for his property. Who's that for the hair? Oh. You have any ID on your boss? Might as well talk to me now, we got you, bro. Nothing else? You got a wallet on you? Yeah. Any ID in here? Yeah. Open that up. All right, just give me that. You have a Jersey City address right now? No? All right. I gotta take his hoodie off and everything like that. Just get comfortable, we're gonna process you now. You're gonna be charged with possession of CDS heroin, okay? During the run, you try to off it. My partner recovered it exactly right where you put it down at the base of the fence, okay? Bushes. Anything you wanna to say to me? All right. All right. We'll bring in your right statement, formally charge you. That was, that was a little bit of a workout for me, thanks, Doug. He jetted right away. Oh, he had a beer in his hand. I told him, put the beer, put, the, put it down, put it down, put it down. He's walking, put, gone. <laughs> I almost ran over. I almost ran the, the baby carriage over going through the corner there. <laughs> a little workout, a little sweat. We're going to go down to uh, headquarters. The uh, actor had an outstanding warrant for shoplifting. Uh, we're going to pick that up. They're going to do a further history check on him. And if anything else pops up, then we'll find out down there. Since I was in high school, I wanted to be a law enforcement officer. I wasn't too picky about where I wanted to work as long as it was in my own hometown. And what had happened was uh, my own hometown actually called me for the job the same time Jersey City did. And uh, I took the job. And, uh, a couple of weeks later, Jersey City called me, and I resigned from uh, Bayonne and went over to Jersey City. Uh, just, uh, just because of the work experience, it's a different type of setting. It's more of an urban setting, a lot more goes on here. When they called me for my interview and whatnot, I kind of started getting excited. I got psyched, and uh, I took the job, and I'm, I'm glad I did. I'm glad, you know, glad when little kids look up to you as a role model. I'm glad when, uh, when you actually help somebody who appreciates your help. The call says it's a security guard inside one of the trailers has no clothes on. An employer called us stating that uh, his employee is locked up in some kind of container. I guess we'll find out what's going on when we get there. Dispatch, you broke up. Yeah. You call? Yeah, I'm the one. What happened? Uh, I was going to the warehouse. It's just down here. Yeah. You know my name, uh, Come over here. I can't hear you by the trucks. Okay. Come over by the trailer. I had someone buying from one of the containers. Which container is it? Can you show it to us? Yeah, one of the trailers, but if I may say, it's inside there. I'm Can you show us? Yeah, we gotta go. Yeah, come on, we'll go over. What, what are you, is you driving us? Yeah. Okay, take this down, I'll follow you. He's gonna apparently show us where someone's locked in a gate or in a, in a trailer it's, or something? They say he's locked in a trailer. It's a security guard, and uh, the gate's locked to access the yard where the trailer is. And uh, it's very unusual for this to happen.
Okay, received. Uh, no further units required. It's 265. Do you know the security guard? Yeah, I know him. You I know, know how he called me a day. Okay. Call him. Negative. NTF5. NTF5. Yeah, F5. We went off of this uh, the SIP Avenue. See if we can render some assistance. Can you just notify the East Squad? It's actually going to be in the yard of 265 Waska Transportation. Uh, we might need some bolt cutters over here. Apparently, there's a uh, someone locked in the trailer. We're gonna try to investigate more. Uh, they also have a uh, call for Broadway. Uh, same thing. Got a security guard in the trailer, naked. Okay, I don't, I don't know. Uh, I don't know yet. He was in the area when he started hearing bang, somebody he banging the on the trailer. Guy. He knows him to be working at this time. Yeah. Who's the security guard? Apparently, it's who's locked in the I trailer. Where the, the naked trailer? ball came from, I have no idea. Right now, he's going to try to get the attention of the of the security guard who really works here, which is who we believe is the one that's locked in some one of the trailers. Um, we also got an emergency service unit stopped to try to cut the chain on the on the fence. Unless he was checking on something, maybe he heard somebody. Yeah, but those doors don't close unless you lock them yourself. You know, they don't it's like slap shut. We found our man. Hey, how you doing? What happened? Who is this? Police. Gang of five guys. One of them was armed. Okay, right. come on down. Come you got your down. shoes? Where's your other shoe? Come on. His glasses, his shoe down here. You all right? Don't put your other shoe back on. You heard it all? <laughs> you all right? You all right, buddy? <laughs> you heard it all? <laughs> I'm going for a bus. <laughs> yeah. Can you start a bus this way? Too? What happened? Relax. I'm upset. <laughs> exactly at 12 o'clock, I was making around over here. That's 255, correct? I was holding a bunch of... Yeah, that's correct. Suddenly, I found okay. five around me. Okay. Okay. They hold me. Five guys? Five guys. Okay. They hold me. Do you remember yeah. what they look like? No, within a couple of minutes. Okay. All this all happened within a couple of minutes. One of them was holding gun and putting some mask on his head. Okay. The others told me, don't look at us, look behind. They put my, my arms. Take, like take your time, relax, yeah. relax. Catch your breath. He's a security guard. They, put, they robbed him and threw him in the trailer. They yeah. put me inside it and locked it. I, I don't know if he... Uh, okay. Yeah. They put me inside it and locked me. I don't know anything after that. After that, about half an hour or one hour, one of them came here. They told me, cops, is that I hear police half hour, half an hour. That's what I hear. I didn't hear anything else. All right. Well, thank God, uh, I guess these actors had a conscience, and apparently they called us up, correct? From the, Absolutely. From the Absolutely. So, um, well, had he stayed in there over the weekend, I mean, he said he was going to be here for a double shift. He would have been dead, no doubt. So right. you, you felt the heat rush out the door when you, when you cracked the trailer door. The ESU unit is a specialized unit. We deal with, uh, well, special activity stuff. Uh, 
you know, uh, tactical situations, we handled uh, vehicle extrications, uh, hostage situations, the type of motor vehicle accidents, uh, all, all specialized stuff that the ordinary uh, patrol unit might not be able to handle. Uh, we could go from, uh, this unit covers ev everything and anything. We could be chasing dogs around for for like an hour and then the next minute you're, you're like doing a tactical entry. That's what's exciting about it. Mercy 4. Sorry, Tom. Hey, Mike, you got an to Warren Street? Yeah, well, we're on the way. All right, we're responding just up the road here to uh, a call about a child struck in the middle of the street by an auto, apparently. All right, emergency four, we're off. Victor! Step back, we got it. Can you see that? Can you back up, please? Johnny, could you back these guys up? Step just back, back please. Them up. We're just here to help, okay? I stand by one minute. Guys, step back, one step. Yeah. Oh, we need some four by four. Yeah, I got You got gloves? I want to five, just to correct us to step up on the right. Yeah, let me have them. That is correct. It stepped up and put it on the right. Just leave those on. Leave those on. You got it? We back up to us the curb, please. Get it up in front. We're going to drive, correct? Where's that car? Look. All right. Vic, you want to you put the collar on? Yeah. All right. Here, 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 here. No, put the pad. Okay, honey. Yeah, I got it. Okay. Get that pad on here. You want to you want to get her neck stabilized yeah. so we yeah. can put this under? Yeah. You want me to hold her neck? Yeah. You want to hold her neck and I'll do it. Let me save it. Come here. Yeah. I have it, Mike. You got it? Okay. Yeah, I have it. I get the glove and just get yeah. that. Slide, slide this under. Slide that under. Yeah. Can you go get the board? Okay. okay. It's all right, honey. All right. Okay. Bring that bring that part in your right hand around to the front. Bring it up to the top. There you go. Now I'll take it. Okay. I'll take it. Very good. Okay. Okay, okay, sweetie, it's okay. okay. Here we go. go it's ahead. okay, honey. Right now, we're we're right. Okay, okay sweetie. Push it okay. Back. You, you want to you wanna put Why the... Uh, yeah. Who, who saw her get hit? Give me a small one. Did the whole car run her over? Why, where did she get all the tire marks from? <laughs> who, who saw what happened? Who saw her get run over? One, two, three, go. All the way back. All the way back. There you go. That's good. Okay, sweetie. All right, see? We got see the leg. Do we have a headbed on, on our truck? Yeah, we got a headbed in Somebody's going to have to go, go get it. Meals. Yeah. You want to go get a headbed for this? I think we got one on our truck. All right, leg? Which that. leg, honey? I got sweetie. it. Did this leg hurt? Did this leg hurt? Oh, okay, sweetie. This one hurt? Does that hurt? Yeah. Okay, honey. Okay. Can you, tie, can you tie that side? Tie it here, please. Right, right to one of these holes here. Just tie it. Put it through and tie it in a knot. And then I'll go, I'll go real tight on my side, okay? What the hell is the MC? Uh, they say go to three minutes. All right, I got it tight. Who's that? Let's well, do what we sergeant. have to do, okay? All right. Just hold off the headbed till we get her. All right, tie, honey. Right? Till we get her tied to the board. Okay, okay sweetie. Okay. <laughs> Mommy's right here, sweetie, okay? It's favoring the, the new lift right this up, leg, yeah. Yeah. All right. I know. All right. Where's the bus? Right here. The bus. Right here. The bus is right here on the We corner. need that stretcher. Grab right. the stretcher, bro. She's ready to go. It's ready to rock. Yeah, she's favoring this leg right here. You know what? Let's just carry her. Pick her up. Ready? We'll bring him to her. Let's go to somebody side. grab our bags. Watch your bags. Please. Watch your bag. Just close the bags and then uh, grab them for us, all right? Listen, her left side of her stomach's very hard. Okay. She's got she got tire marks on her. She's okay. favoring okay. her uh, right ankle. Guys, go to side. Side. She's got a cut on the left side of her head. Okay. okay. Stand by for the captain. Watch that, watch that. Watch the door. Guys, right here. Here we are. Right here. Here we are. Unbuckle the straps there. She got hit by a car. It looks now that she might have got run over because she got tire marks on her shirt. We didn't see the car. How long she got tire marks? Was she conscious when you got there? Yes. She's got tire marks on her body, her leg. Her left side of her stomach's hard and rigid. All right. She's got a cut on the left side of her head. Okay.
She's bleeding from the rear, too. So. Gummy, gummy, gummy. Once we did the patient assessment, she's favoring that leg, okay? Okay. It looks like there's a. Ready? Ready? You okay, honey? You'll be okay. Did I? No. Yeah. Thanks. Hey, old two. So she ran. She ran in the street and she ended up in between the cars. Is what you're saying? She got hit and the little brother, went in between the cars. The, little, the sister came and got me and told me that her brother was chasing her and said that when her brother was chasing her, uh -huh. she ran from him and got hit by a car. Okay. Did the wheels go over her? Or did she just get flung back? No, you don't, do you know? I don't. You know? If yeah, if, well, don't let us confuse you if you don't. Because it's going to help. Okay. It's going to help medically. The she's saying she's saying the wheels went under her, so okay. she probably well, that, means that, the that, car went over her. Yeah. Grandma's got to get in. You got to open that door. Two years old. Two years old. Uh, basically, uh, the child's going to be uh, brought to a medical center, and uh, hopefully she'll she'll be all right. Yeah. They said uh, something about she was being chased by her brother or something. Yeah, went out and then into she the ran into the street and the car ran over her leg or something right. like that. At this point, it, it appears that she has uh, some stomach injuries and uh, injuries to her extremities, and she's got some uh, head injuries with some blood coming out of her ear. So it's a shame. That's that's the worst part to deal with is the little kids. One thirty-two in Bush. I've got him at gunpoint. Okay, gunpoint. One thirty-two in Bush. Covers code three. Okay, we'll still send a code three. 